for me, the set list, you know, it starts with the core songs that I feel like I have to, not only have to do, but want to do. You know, I'm always gonna do Hold My Hand. I'm always gonna do Get High. Probably gonna always do Girl Next Door and Love Can Go to Hell from my second record. And then from there, I get to play around a little bit and I try to put in, you know, a couple of new songs that, that I haven't recorded that I might record for my next record to just see how they go over. And then I try to do a cover tune that maybe inspired me. I want my set to feel like a ride to the audience. And so if I had my druthers, I'd probably do 15 ballads, but it, it is about entertaining that crowd. So we really have only one true ballad in the set on purpose. Now somebody else might hear my set and be like, one true ballad? There's three in there. But to us, there's really only one real ballad. And so it's about keeping it up and, um, and telling stories. And I want the, the audience to go on a journey you know, to feel like they hit a roller coaster of emotions, of laugh, cry, think. You know, when they leave, I, I, I want them to not only be humming the songs, but thinking about the lyrics. Lately, we've been doing Good Hearted Woman, the Waylon and Willie song, and we do that out of a song of mine called Daughter, which I love doing it out of that song. and. Uh, I love connecting songs. That's another thing I love to do in a set list. We have two times in the set where we connect two songs. And I think because as an, as an audience member, that always impresses me. When I see a live show and you're in one thing and then boom, you're in another. And it's like, how did they get to that? I'm a co-writer on the Miranda Lambert hit Mama's Broken Heart. So we've done that. We, we started doing that in Santa Barbara and we'll do it again tonight. And that's been fun. Even though I wrote that song, it is technically a cover and, and it's a fun one because these audiences know that song.